This programme contains strong language, sexual scenes and references from the beginning and throughout. Nothing brings everyone closer than a good little prank on Nathan, and I know how much Nathan loves chilli, especially on his pizza. Nathan, eat up. Nathan, you've got to eat the rest of the food first. Have some scrambled. Come on, I'm, I'm just eating it by myself. I think it's getting a bit chilly in here, isn't it? Nathan, feed him. Feed him to the lions. It's just easy pickings, man. Oh, you like that one? <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> You sly little bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Spicy, was it? Why would you do that to me? Easy now. Easy now. Easy now. <laughs> Nathan is in a bad way. Frank's a side over here. I mean, that was funny, though. He can't even get up the stairs on his own. Hughes, no, I need some water now. Hughes, I need some water now. Someone just get me some fucking water. Water, did you say, Nathan? I am more than happy to help. Fuck me, that hot chilli water, mate. Chilli water. <laughs> Have some of that, fam. <laughs> <laughs> Someone help. <laughs> Give him some chilli water. I'm trying to get to sleep, and all I can hear is a load of racket. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> <laughs> Why do I end in the back? Oh, here, yeah, Nathan, you are looking your best like. Let me give you a makeover. It's one thing to make me sick, but it's a whole different level putting shit in my fucking hair. You've well and truly pissed us off now. One bit, three more, I'd be sick. Whoa! Then all of a sudden, boom, like a bat out of hell, Nathan's up, grabbing his sick bag, and he starts fucking chasing me. <laughs> Chance, Gary, you're the one who pranked him. I only put shit in his hair. If it wasn't me. Nathan, all this running around and eating chilies must have you hot. Why don't you go for a swim? <laughs> we are absolutely terrified of Nathan. I don't know what's got into him. He's swinging that sick bag like a hooker's handbag. Where are you going? Everyone is in the house apart from me. Shock. You'll never escape me, bitch. I need to get there as soon as possible. So you run. <laughs> I actually now feel like I'm in a horror film. I am shit scared of Nathan. You genuinely think that you're a fire in the house? If these motherfuckers think locking me out the house is going to stop me getting to them, they have another thing coming. Then the big, drunk, naked bastard comes steaming through the window. <laughs> and I'm off at this point. Fuck that. <laughs> Here's Nathan. Tonight's been proper mental. We've all had such a good laugh together. But enough's enough, Nathan. Let's put you to bed before you cause any more damage. Oh, okay, I just one thing. By the way, while I was outside, the bird shot on me. <laughs> <laughs> shot on me. Like, I can't even deal with it. <laughs>